back to the Teeny Tinkers channel. I make ball joint doll and craft related content. Today I have an unboxing. Um, so I have my package from Dark Hour Dolls, but they decided to bundle that in my mailbox with all of this stuff from AliExpress. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and open all of this, but I'm going to start, of course, with the Dark Hour Dolls package because that's the one I'm most excited for. So. Let's get into it. The owner of the shop launched on January 2nd or 3rd, I believe. And I ordered, I think it was order number three, but I'm very excited to get into this. Order number two, here we go, look at that. Order number, okay. Order number two, a little thank you card. First five. Rosie, thank you for your continued support and encouragement, thanks. Thanks. Of course, Jesse. Um, these are really cute cards, too. As a thank you for being one of the first five, please enjoy $5 off your next order with a special code. Woo! But I will definitely be holding on to that and using that. There is a dress I have my eye on. So, oh gosh, okay. So, let's get into this. Oh, okay. So, I got a pair of black knee high socks. And this super cute split plaid skirt. I imagine Millie in this. I just think she would look so, 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 so cute. And um, yeah, I'm just really excited to get this on her. This one I more have Era or Margo in mind maybe. I'm not really sure, but I just couldn't help but buy this really cute like plaid with hearts. I just thought the fabric was so cute. And I love Jessie's pleated skirts. If you're gonna buy anything, buy the pleated skirts or the sweatshirts. And then I got a black cardigan because I loved August pink one so much. So I got the black one thinking it'll probably fit August, but it will also probably go with Margot and she needs more jackets all the time. So, and I also wanna take a second and just say congrats to Jessie for launching her shop. Everything is great. I'm really happy with the quality and the fabrics. You should definitely go check her out if you haven't already. She's a Canadian. It's a Canadian based shop and all the prices are in Canadian dollars. So, I mean, if you're in Canada, that's amazing. If you're in the US or somewhere else in the world, then just know that our dollar is not very strong. So the prices are great. They're so good. So go check her out now. Okay, so let's put that to the side for now and then get into some of this other stuff. Let's hope it's like kind of doll or shop related, huh? Okay, so it is doll related. I got this really cute, it's bigger than I thought, but that's okay, um, Sanrio plush for, uh, for Millie's bedroom. It's a keychain, I believe. A lot of these plushes the size are keychains. It looks like it's actually licensed, which is interesting and awesome. Like, I'm always very excited when it's official things take that off because I don't need that but it's super soft and fluffy there's a couple other ones and I'm thinking about going back to the others now because this is very 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 cute I will be removing this big tag because I think it gives away how like it ruins the scale illusion so I'm just gonna the little one can stay though because I think it's the correct scale for a tag you might see on a doll this size but super squishy, really, really cute, really fluffy, adorable in white. I love this. Okay, on to this one. Gotta check to make sure I'm not cutting whatever's in the box. Okay, so we have another keychain and these are props. These are. Um, the coffee drinks I ordered. Oh, wait, one's a coffee drink and one's a Coca-Cola. And the scale looks like it is going to be perfect. So I have a Starbucks double shot. And again, there's just a twist thing, so. We'll get the little top bit after, but there's this little Starbucks double shot. Ooh, 
Very cute little props. I think they're resin. I'm not sure. This one might be. But yeah, those are really great. Rolls away. All right, next up, we have this green bag. <laughs> and it's Margo's plushie. So again, another keychain. Uh, this one is Studio Ghibli. Got the tag and all that. And it's, uh, oh my gosh, what's the cat's name? What does it say? No. But it's the kitty cat from, um, I'm just pulling off the keychain. It's the kitty cat from Kiki's Delivery Service. And I thought it would look extra cute on Margot's bed, and I think I am right, because it's super, super cute. He's baby. If you're looking for plushies for your dolls definitely check out like keychain plushies because I found so many great keychains to use as props for MSDs and honestly these would work for SD as well okay next up we have oh, okay so these are just a bunch of buttons I got to make cardigans with and stuff so if you're into uh, rainbow buttons keep an eye out for those in the shop a little bit less exciting but Nonetheless, this one is, it looks like my floor stickers, but they're definitely not as big as I thought. I ordered these to be um, flooring for my shelf. I think I might be able to use them anyways. Uh, they aren't as big as I thought, bummer, but I could have checked the dimensions, honestly, that's my bad. They do look nice. I might have to straighten or like, iron this crease out but yeah I wanted to change up uh, the flooring and change up the room I'm doing like white and stuff now so yeah just some nice dollhouse floor you can check out like I searched um, dollhouse floor sticker but you can also find like tile and everything else so if you're making a diorama like not a bad place to check out okay we have three two left. We have two left. I'm going to do, I think this one might be yarn. I think some of these might be yarn. This is model toys. So we have this one here. It says model toys. I always love trying to remember what it is. Oh, okay. Oh, these are much bigger than, I ordered these for my kids. They're just among us uh, crewmates. I have a really tiny one for Margo and they loved it, so I bought these thinking they were the same, but they are much, much bigger, but also very, very cute. But yeah, these are for my kids. I would say, I will link them below anyways, because I'm pretty sure you could use these as plushies for SDs. They might be a bit big for MSDs, but I mean, they could always be those giant oversized ones. But they're keychains and they're super cute, so yeah. Finally, we have the big one, and the big one says, Dollhouse Potted Succulent Plants. Ooh, these might be my plants. Okay, so I ordered a bunch of plants for the yellow room, the living room, because um, I have a shelf on the wall, and it needed plants. So I got, oh, okay. You ever just lose your scissors in the pile of things? So the first thing I got was, isn't actually a little plant. It's this teeny tiny little globe. It actually turns. Let's see. It's very, very cute, and I wanted to put that in Margot's room because she likes all this kind of like vintage stuff. She's got a clock in there too, so that I really like. It's very, ah, oh, throws it. It's very heavy too. And then we have all of the little plants. Let's start here because it's the most wrapped. Rips. So 
what do we have here? We have, <laughs> aw, it's so cute. It's a teeny tiny little terrarium with like a little blue succulent in it. So it's just real cute, teeny tiny. Yeah, that's so cute. I might put that one in Millie's room just because the blue is so nice. And then we have this little guy. Super cute little plant. I mean, these are all gonna be little plants, but again, I just searched for dollhouse plants. This really nice yellow one yellow and green obviously and I picked ones that have mostly white bases oh this one's really nice I very much like this one I have a plant just like this and then I have a little bag with some succulents in it part of me wishes that there were succulents this small that would stay this small so that I could have real plants in my dioramas. But I also think that that might be a lot of work and just asking for an accident. So it's just these four little succulents, just four little ones in these like clay pots. They've got stuff on them, but they're super adorable. Okay. What's your favorite item here? Besides the clothes, which are obviously my favorite, um, I really like this blue succulent and I really love this little Sanrio character. I just think this is so adorable and I'm excited to set it up in my diorama. Speaking of the diorama, would you guys maybe like to see a diorama tour at some point? Let me know. If you're already subscribed to my channel, thank you so much for subscribing. And if you're new here, I hope you like the content and will consider subscribing. As always, I hope you have a fantastic day.